If you're doing what everyone else is doing, you're doing it wrong. Hey guys, what is going on? My name is Cody, the guy you see on screen is Eli, and today we have a huge collection from our vending machine business. We have a very sweet video, so to speak. Look at that gumball machine, seven feet tall. Very, very huge. Go ahead and pop a quarter in it. So they call us about uh, this machine was jammed, but as you can see, Eli got a gumball without any issue. So let's go ahead and crack this puppy open and see if we can't find out what was wrong with it. Go ahead and take that off and look at all of that. I think I found the issue and look at it. It was so full jamming the coin mech. Absolutely incredible. Look at all that. Let's get inside there. Yeah. Let's go ahead and pull it out. It's kind of tricky. It's got like a hook inside there that you attach that uh, plastic piece to. All right. Let's go over to the table and see how much we got. We're looking at 219. And that is freaking amazing. All from a gumball machine. Granted, it's a seven foot tall gumball machine. Just absolutely insane. We actually got this gumball machine from CaneyMachines.com. Great people, great place. Nice, clean housing. And I think we're gonna have to check up on this more. This is a 45 day collection, which includes at least a week they were closed while remodeling. So. Nerd Gumballs, of course, was using the machine. The kids love it. They actually were taking a picture by the machine as we were leaving. But uh, a $2,200 gumball machine is well worth it for a uh, such a unique place as they have there with all that ice cream. But let's go ahead and move on to the Mexican restaurant. I'm sure some of you guys have seen this place before, and it does fantastic. Look at all that awesome plush in there. It's been a few days shy of a month for the kitty crane, but uh, we'll open it up and see how she does. Let's go ahead and fill it full of awesome stuff. Got Ninja Turtles in there. We got Pokemon cards, Avengers... Squishies. Good stuff. Go ahead and shut that door. I think that's the first time I've locked the door myself on camera. Alright, let's go ahead and take a peek at these quarters. Now we are going to collect, so I guess it's not a peek, more of a wow. Look at that. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and dump it. 61.75. Can't complain. But it has been better in the past. Again, this is a uh, this is a shorter collection. You know, we're a few days shy, but not too bad. Look at that. And we're looking at $92 in his hand right there. That is all right. Very nice. 
All right. Let's see those guys together. There we go. Looking good. All right, and we are at a tattoo parlor. This has been on location for 60 days. Looking pretty low. I know um I know if some people pass out if they don't have their blood sugar you know just right for all that <clears throat> that shock to your body but let's go ahead and open the door and look at that not bad what do you guys think should I get a quick play tattoo comment in the section below this is one of the few spots that we pay a commission on bulk go ahead and dump out all these quarters look at that and then we got the fries at the bottom of the bag we're friends Love with it. the owner. All right, let's go ahead and move on to the scale. 77. Not bad. That means... That means thirty-eight fifty a month, so it's a pretty good spot. Pretty good. Let's go ahead and move to our other Mexican location. It's looking pretty bare. Looking pretty good. That's what I like to see. Let's go ahead and open this up and fill it full of toys and plush. Now looking in this crane right now, what is your favorite plush? Or wait till Eli fills it up and let me know what you would go for. Let me know in the comment section below. All right, let's go ahead and crack this puppy open and see how she did. So before we get into that, this is a jam right here. This is a pretty bad jam too. Look at all those quarters shoved in there. You see the buttons pushed in. And my last video, I showed you guys that the button was pushed in, but we didn't really get into detail of, you know, what we did and how we handled that situation now we have these little tools that you can get at anywhere really Walmart I believe we got ours at Harbor Freight for like I don't know like three four five bucks but look how he just scoops scrapes those quarters out it's kinda like a like a dental tool looking deal and you can just get in there and knock all the all the jammed quarters around and they will just fall right out there was like a buck fifty just shoved inside of that coin mech. Good thing that there's two. And Eli gave us the thumbs up, so we're good to go. Alright guys, we are back to the money. So let's go ahead and open it up. Get that lock off. Open that door. We're gonna go. We're gonna go for the quarters first. And look at that. Oh yeah. Whenever you're having problems dumping quarters into a bag, that's a good problem to have, guys. So, stay happy at the frustration of spilling quarters, people walking in the door, being in the way, and it's all awkward, and it all works out. Look at all that money. Pick up the scapies. Let's see what we got in the bill acceptor, the magazine. Look at that. Holy crap. 
that made it into the second magazine. That is insane. Just look at that. Wow. Insane. And that is $171. Good stuff. That nice slow-mo. That's how you do it. All right, let's go ahead and go to the bar and see how much we got. This is one month collection per usual, or so we try. And just that cash stack alone, guys, it just goes to show that you just need one spot like this and it just like catapults you into this industry and it just gives you this this love of it because you you can see how possible it is 147 and quarters that's 770 dollars in profit today guys two hours of work all right but i'm going to give a shout out to our boy jamie farnsworth he is awesome guys you're done with this video go over there watch all of his he is the man i'm going to go ahead and end it here guys we're almost at 3,000 subscribers thank you so much subscribe hit that like button i'll see you next time goodbye